Hi, I'm Don Wilson, the TAC Doctor. For part two of this video, we're going to talk about safety during an installation. Specifically, two things you should never, ever do. Remember, if you're not an expert, get a qualified electrician to help you with your installation. First, never ever mount the inverter in an engine compartment near fuel or anywhere there's a danger of exposure to flammable gas. Inverters can produce internal sparks in their operation and should not be considered ignition protected unless specifically designed as such. Second, never ever ground the neutral wire in your vehicle. In housing, we know that the neutral wire is grounded at some point in the building and that's fine for a structure that always has an earth ground connection. In a vehicle or a boat, this is a dangerous thing to do. The inverter will ground its neutral automatically when it's inverting, which is safe, but if there's a grounded neutral wire somewhere else, this could cause what's called a hot skin and can easily result in electrocution. You see, those electrons traveling through the wire are all looking to get to earth ground when on a shore receptacle. The return path is the neutral wire. If the neutral wire is grounded, then the chassis becomes part of the neutral return path. If you touch the vehicle while standing on wet ground, you could become part of the return path and that's not a good thing. Remember, follow all regulations and codes when installing and always be safe so you can enjoy your inverter for many years to come. I'm Don Wilson, the Tech Doctor. For more information and additional Tech Doctor articles, go to Xantrex.com and click on Tech Doctor.